Uh, I focus a lot on outcomes. Uh, I've long uh, believed that input is what we do and how we do it. And it matters a lot less than the outcome we're after. So if you think about an event, I have zero clients that put on events because they're bored. I have absolutely no clients that call me and say, we have so much money, it's obscene, and we don't know what to do with it. I wish they would. <laughs> but the point is an event or bringing in a consultant or an advisor is really aimed at some sort of an outcome. It's aimed at creating some sort of a result. So I kind of, and, 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 and Covey says the same thing, right? Start with the end in mind. So I start with that outcome and we kind of work our way backwards, right? So if this is what we're trying to get to, what is it going to take for us to get there? Um, the other thing I'm, I'm passionate about and I think I do well is I'm a big believer of uh, the old notion of teaching clients how to fish. So whether it's speaking, I, I feel like I'm on stage and my job is to be Yoda. My job is to share with the audience how they can replicate a process or an approach to something. If it's consulting, how do I do a knowledge transfer? So first Fridays don't just become David's idea, it's how do we implement that in our change management initiative over the next two years to ensure its success. The other thing that I, that I love doing is I, and I think I do well is I frame situations pretty quickly. I, I don't need all the backstory. And I can very quickly frame what I believe is the challenge or the opportunity. Uh, and, I, and I like to think I convey maybe my credibility, my experience through the questions I ask. It's very easy for me or others to provide an answer. It's a lot more fun and, and clients get a great deal more value from it if I lead them down this path that they're dying to go, which is how do we solve this issue, how do we solve this problem through great questions.